Hey guys, this is my unboxing of the WE High Cap of 5.1 um, Dragon Type B from WeTech or WE. Um, I got this from Pyramid Air. It comes. To, I also bought um 0.25 gram BB silicone oil and a propane adapter, and um all of that and plus this gun cost me 119 with the coupon code down below in the link. Um. So this is the main thing I got from everything. This is my first gas blowback pistol that I got in so far. So let's see what it does. Um, by the way, I would open this already and use this gun. So um, let's see. So it comes in this normal box, really nothing much to it. Just their logo, and inside of it is just foam padding, nothing much. And inside you'll get an Allen wrench. This is supposed to be in a Ziploc baggie. But it's not in there. Um, this is what you need to disassemble the gun, most of the part. But this is your gun. Let's put that aside for one brief second here. Um, that's your manual. In the bottom, if you guys, if you don't know. But that's all you pretty much get in the box. So this gun, if you can get through it clearly, um. This is the Type B version. Type A will will not have these slash patterns. If you notice that Type A will have just normal um, M19, M1911 style um, dashes, pretty much. And um, also the gold emblem right there. And also these portholes right in the fixed slide. This Type A will have like round shape. But this, you can see, it's more um, oval or more just like vents so um it also has a removal orange slide which you can remove or and also has a threaded tip if you want to add a um compensator or anything to it like a suppressor or a silencer Ugh. um this is full metal all right let's move this slide for one minute Everything is, everything here is metal. Um, I will explain the metal parts right now. Let's just slide this back for a minute. Um, this whole piece right here is metal. This slide is metal. The front slide is metal. The orange tip is metal. The outer barrel is metal. Inner barrel is metal. Um, hop up. I'm not. Um. I believe it's also metal and this is plastic right here oh this is also metal the the um the hammer is also metal or aluminum um the lock and the safety is all metal and the sl sl slide um release so the sides are fixable you can adjust them with these screw right here and sorry about the camera and the screw right here you can twist those you can adjust left to right up and down so not too much and your um your front the front sight does have a what you call it fiber optic sight so the magazine is also full metal everything's full metal from this magazine this is just plastic and that's pretty much all about it. And this is your filling hole, if you guys don't know that, but yeah, alright. So, this gun, and also your um, magazine release switch button is also metal. Just if you want to know. And your trigger is also metal. That's pretty neat. So, slide back, release this. I don't want to do it too loud, but um, that's pretty much it. This is has ambidextrous safety switch. And that's all I can say about it. Pretty much, it's pretty, pretty much a basic pistol. And whew, I can't reach over either. This is the propane I use. I also use this silicone oil, which I also brought from them. Um, yeah, this silicone oil I used to spray in here. And then that's my propane adapter. It cost me like fourteen bucks for this. Not a bad price. So you know, one of those um. Coleman green tanks for camping. You take the mag out, 
and you fill it in right there. So that's not all much to it. And BBs go down. It's a speed loader in the. It's a speed loader right in this open area right there. Or I can get get it right. I'm sorry, right there. So, um, this is pretty much just a quick done on review. Um, if you want to see the shooting review of this gun, I will have a video link up soon of it now. Um, if not, then soon. If you guys are watching this earlier, but that's pretty much it. Cool slide. Alright guys, take care and have fun.